Julius Mutemi, and uh, I've been working here as a lamp technician. I've been helping the pharmacist, I've been helping the uh, consultation, I've been helping the delivery room, and I thank God for his service. I've also been doing the mobile clinic at Munong, and I still help in the same field, treating and uh, also preaching the gospel of Christ to the people and the children here. My name is Lydia Kimanzi. I'm a nurse in FEM. I've been a nurse for the past 20 years. And now I'm managing the center. It has been great to see the work grow as I'm also been in this work for that long. We have really helped a lot of people in the community. It's a work that needs a lot of support and prayers because we reach to the hearts of the most needy and destitute in the communities. And we pray that God will open up more doors for more clinics to reach to the people who cannot afford medical 
services from the government hospitals or private hospitals. We look for your support and prayers in this work. Thank you. I'm Julius Macau. I'm a pastor with Penny Faith Baptist Church of South Kenya. Currently, I'm working with Fame as child administrator. And so, um, I've been in Fame for 14, or more than 14 years, rather. Uh, along with that, I still serve in a local church. And I would like uh, Christians to pray for Fame's work. And apart from helping children with um, poverty and the needs they have, we still do evangelism that we may see those uh, permanent changes and even we see them in heaven when we get there. That will be our ultimate joy uh, because it is our main item. Otherwise, also we need to pray for the churches around. We are working under very difficulty uh, situations or challenges, but the Lord enables us to slowly by slowly overcome uh, each one, each and every one. Yeah, we rejoice always. My name is Grace, and I'm a missionary working here with them. And uh, the thing I would like you to pray for the most is for uh, strength and energy to do their work because it's a lot, and also opportunities for evangelism that God would open more doors and even send more servants to do his work.
beg you to pray for my family. Say hello. 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 Okay, that's it. <laughs> Done. Well, it's been rather hard because the culture is so different here. Mm -hmm. Pray that we won't be so homesick, please. First Emily was sick and then William, so could you pray that, that William and Emily would not get sick again for any of us? Thank you. Thank you. Hello, my name is Aaron Dunlap and this is my wife Grace. This is our youngest son, Thomas, and we work here at the FAME Child Rescue Centre. Our work here at FAME is four part. There's the child rescue, there's the medical, there's the evangelism, and there's helping the local churches with a program called EMU, Evangelical Ministries, Fukumbani. Uh, my prayer, of course, particularly as I come out to work with the Bible College, is particularly uh, for the help in the local churches, that we'll be able to teach the pastors, to support the pastors, so that they can support themselves, and that the, the church will grow, grow in discipline, grow numerically, and in discipleship among the local churches. Have you a prayer request, Mom? Um, just for our contentment, I suppose. Uh, with a new lifestyle, a new country, a lot of new things. Um, it's been a difficult adjustment in some ways uh, for the children. They're missing home, missing friends. So just that the Lord would really give us a peace and a settledness um, and that we could really enjoy serving him while we're here and for continued health. Thank you. Hey, Thomas. <laughs> what would you like us to pray for you? Uh, no. <laughs> no. Yeah. <laughs> when he sees you, that he follows. <laughs> <laughs> Mmm, yummy. <laughs>